everyone, what's up? It's Amanda. Today I have my updated desk tour. Now if you've watched my old desk tour, this is almost 100% new, everything but my MacBook. And if you see my next one, I'm going to have a dedicated office, which I'm really excited about as soon as we move. And in fact, we haven't been in our own home for almost six months, so I really can't wait. So starting off on the right hand side, I have my Rhino Slider Evo. On top of my desk, I have this really awesome picture that I made through a company called Hipture. Those are all photos I took of my daughter and stuff at the beach and things around here locally in Corpus Christi, Texas. I used to just have a basic $30 Target chair, but it started really hurting my back. So last year for Christmas, I was given the gift of this chair and it's about a three or $400 chair, but it's really customizable on how you can get it to fit your body. And it's extremely nice looking and it feels great on my back. What powers my desk is a 2012 15-inch MacBook Pro. And on top of that, to the right-hand side, you see a 2TB G drive. All of this should be on a stand that's been on back order for two months from Amazon. But then just beside that, I have the Focusrite Forte for my audio interface. I love the big knobs and the touch control and the DAC, and it sounds amazing. My monitor is a 27-inch MX27AQ by ASUS. It's a frameless monitor, which is really awesome. And then it's got this really thin design and it's just, it looks fantastic. It's 26 by 1440 and it's under 500 bucks. And it's got this sundial design with this metal frame and I couldn't have any more nice things to say about it. I absolutely love it. After my monitor, I have the Rose Gold Moto 360 second generation. My desktop speakers are the Audio Engine A2 Pluses. They are some of the best looking and best sounding speakers. Then I have my Apple Watch around the Nomad charging pod, which you can take with you and charge your watch on the go. It's got an external battery built in. And like always, I'll have all this linked down below. So if you guys want to check anything out inside my drawers here, this is one of my favorite items. It's 20 bucks and it's a wireless media streamer and it is fantastic. Make sure you guys check that out. And then I have a Qi charger from Chotec. This is a quirky cable keeper to keep all your cables from falling down behind your desk. Here is some extra cables I have, and I have these, these little orange things are actually reusable zip ties. And then I have some extra of those down in here just so that I can quickly grab them. And I will be using these whenever I redo my whole setup, but that won't be till I move. Just underneath my Nexus 7, I have an extra SD card that's brand new, along with a 10% off movers coupon from Best Buy from when I moved. And here in the right hand side, you can see some Velcro straps along with some change and an SD card. And then here's an extra package of the Q-Knots, which are the reusable ties. The black mat on my desk is the Aris Extended Mouse Pad, and it's really got some nice quality to it. The logo is metal, and it's actually finished off with thread instead of just being open on the edges mouse I am using is the Logitech MX Master Mouse. And then I have a new wireless mechanical keyboard by Varmillo. This has Gateron clear switches and it has these awesome front printed keycaps and I am absolutely in love with this. It is quite expensive, but it's also a Bluetooth mechanical keyboard, which is fantastic. My daily driver phone is the new iPhone 6S Plus. It is in rose gold and 64 gigabytes. And that's sitting on a wooden stand by Ilago. I don't remember the model number, but it's a really nice looking stand. It's pretty secure. It'll work for an iPad or a phone. Just behind that, I have the Aeneer Smart Charging 7 port USB hub. And to the left of that sitting on my headphone stand is the Neo2Go speaker. This is a portable wireless speaker that's great for on the go. If you have an NFC device, you can connect real simply using that. The dials on the top make it really easy to use. And then here on the side, you can see is just a charging port. And as you can see, I've got some sand all around this thing, but it's wireless and you can actually even take it in your shower. So the company actually sells this as a shower speaker and it works great for that. It has really nice quality, but my favorite feature is the fact that I can plug in my Audio Engine A2 speakers to the auxiliary port and turn them into wireless speakers. So if I wanna stream from my phone, I connect this to my speakers through their input and I have wireless speakers now. My headphones are the III TMA2s, which I've reviewed, and then these are sitting on an Ilago Space Gray stand. My microphone stand is the Rode PSA-1 boom arm, and on top of that, I have the Audio Engine MX70s, which I M70X, excuse me, which I use for monitoring whatever I'm recording, and the microphone that I use for all my videos and right now that I am recording this with is the Blue Spark. This is the limited edition platinum color because it's normally orange. 
notes side of my desk, I have the iPad mini 2 and that's sitting on the 12 South book arc. And then there's a beer bottle that I have a bamboo plant in. And just behind that, I have a seven port Aki uh, USB port adapter. Here I have a Lissi two terabyte rugged drive. And then there's my little plant up there. Hello plant. Moving over to the right hand side inside the drawer. These colored little remotes are for my LED light strips. I have a couple of them, but I only use one right now. Here is the Note 4 Edge. This is the iPhone 6 Plus in gold. The Samsung Galaxy S6 Edge in gold. And then this is the, I guess it's a black, I don't know what call, color you call it, gunmetal LG G4. And then I have two of these, a 10,000 and a 20,000 milliamp portable battery, as well as tucked in back here, a Mophie, I think 6,000 milliamp battery. And tucked away under my desk is the Audio Engine S8 subwoofer, which sounds fantastic. And my desk has this awesome cable management to keep it all nice and tidy. Well guys, that pretty much wraps it up. If you like this video, please give it a thumbs up. If you're new to the channel, hit that subscribe button and I'll see you guys in the next video.